Hello everyone and welcome back to Jackalit Educational Channel. So this video is all about the ASRB recruitment for the year 2021 and in this video we will know all the doubts and all the queries related to the ASRB net, the ICR net, what are the eligibility, what will be the fellowship and every all doubts I will try to clear in this video. So stay tuned till the last of this video to clear all your doubts. So pehle hum shuru karenge to form the extension of the last date of online application. Yes. This ASRB Rednet is actually Agriculture Scientist Recruitment Board. This is the organizing board and this is having the notice on 23rd of April of 2021 that the extension of the last date of submission for the online application form for the three examination that is ARS, NET and STO. So what are these three examination? So we'll know one by one. First we should know the last date for the examination application form for all these three examination is now 10th of May 2021 because of this COVID-19 pandemic. So it was actually 25th of April. Now it is extended till 10th of May 2021. So now we'll know all about these three examination, their pattern, how to appear for them. So let's start with the NET exam. So first before starting for the NET, we should know that this is a combined exam, combined exam for three exam that is NET that is agriculture related AC, ASRC board and then that is second thing is agriculture research service another exam and the third exam is senior technical officer that is STO in the field of agriculture. So this three examination, ye tino exam ka combined ek exam hoga and all these three exam are having different stages. Yes. If you are applying for the net only that is ASRB net you will be able to apply for only one exam that is one stage. If you are applying for the ARS service that is agriculture research service ke liye agar aap apply kar rahe hain to you have to go through three stages. Yes one will be the preliminary exam that is the combined exam one will be the main exam and the other one will be the viva was or the interview. Similarly, if you are senior technical officer, ke liye apply kar rahe hai, to here also there are two stages. Only for NET it is one, for ARS it is three stages and STO it is two stages. That means STO ke liye pehle jo hai preliminary examination hoga, then there will be one interview. So these three are the basic thing and the exam which will be conducted will be one exam preliminary and accordingly you will be able to apply for the other stages if you want. So you should know that why I am telling this. So these are the examination dates which were proposed earlier but now it is all changed so we don't know. So because now the last date of application for the fee payment as well as the online application is now 10th of May 2021. So this is not the matter of concern. We will know that if you are applying for the only net that is ASRB net then one exam you will have to give. So that exam will also consider the ARS post that is agriculture research service same exam will also consider for the first stage of the STO that is senior technical officer uske baad kya hoga uske mark ke basis mein you will be going to give the mains exam if you qualify for the ARS then you will be going for the viva was for the ARS but if you are applying for the post of that is STO you will only have to give this exam then you will have to give the interview so STO ke liye two steps and ARS ke liye three and NET ke liye only one step as we have discussed in the previous slides and these dates have been changed. So next thing we'll know that when you're filling up the application there will be options given which thing we are applying for. Kis cheez ke liye aap apply kar rahe hai? Aap agar tino cheez ke liye apply kar rahe hai to you have to tick on the three boxes but if you're only applying for the NET part you have to apply only for the one box you have to check that is the first one. So why I am telling this is if you are applying for the three posts then it is not that you have to apply and you have to give only one fee. So if you are paying you have to pay for the three thing if you are applying for the three part. Yes ARS ke liye unreserved category is 500 rupees fees. For NET if you are only applying it is 1000. For STO post if you are applying it is 500 rupees. So all together if you are applying for the three post three examinations then you have to pay 2000 rupees for the unreserved category and similarly these are the tariffs or the fees for the other categories. Now you will know one by one that before knowing you should know why it is different from the ICAR net. Yes this ICAR net is actually different from the net which you are going to give in this ASRB net because this ICAR net is conducted by the NTA. Isko NTA conduct karta hai. 
और उसका नोटिफिकेशन अभी तक नहीं आया है एंड दिस इज द वेबसाइट विच इज हैंडल बाय द एन टी एच इज कंडक्टिंग एंड दिस इज अंडर द आई सी ए आर नेट एंड हियर यू कैन गेट द फेलोशिप आफ्टर क्वालिफाइंग द नेट यू कैन गेट द फेलोशिप इफ यू आर ज्वाइनिंग इन द यूनिवर्सिटीज फॉर द एग्रीकल्चर विच आर अंडर द आई सी आर सो दिस इज डिफरेंट फ्रॉम द एग्जाम विच यू आर टॉकिंग नाउ बिकॉज दिस इज वेरी डिफरेंट दिस इज कंडक्टेड बाई एन टी ए एंड द एग्जाम विच वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट इज कंडक्टेड बाय द ए एस आर बी सो फर्स्ट विल नो अबाउट द नेट पार्ट दैट इज ए एस आर बी नेशनल एलिजिबिलिटी टेस्ट इफ यू आर अप्लाइंग फॉर दिस नेशनल एलिजिबिलिटी टेस्ट अंडर दिस ए एस आर बी एग्जाम देन वट विल बी द बेनिफिट इसमें हमें फायदा क्या होगा सो यू विल बी एबल टू क्वालिफाई फॉर द पोजिशन ऑफ लेक्चरर और असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर सो यू कैन से लाइक यू जी सी नेट इज कंडक्टिंग फॉर लेक्चरशिप दैट इज एल एस सिमिलरली दिस इज ओनली यू विल बी एबल टू क्वालिफाई फॉर द पोस्ट ऑफ लेक्चरर और असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर सो इट इज ओनली द क्वालिफाइंग एग्जाम एंड आफ्टर दैट वेन इट विल बी एप्लीकेबल दैट द पोस्ट विल बी वैकेंट फॉर द लेक्चरर्स और द असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर इन द एग्रीकल्चर यूनिवर्सिटीज ओनली नॉट इन द एनवायरमेंटल साइंस एंड अदर सो इफ यू आर एस्किंग फॉर द एग्रीकल्चर यूनिवर्सिटी देन द वैकेंसी विल बी आउट एंड इफ यू हैव क्वालिफाइड दिस नेट एग्जाम देन यू विल बी एबल टू अप्लाई देयर देन यू विल गो अकॉर्डिंग टू देयर प्रोसीजर्स देयर वाई वाई एंड दिज आर ऑल डिफरेंट थिंग्स सो ये सिर्फ आपको असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर के लिए लेक्चरर के लिए एलिजिबल बना देता है इसका मतलब ये नहीं है कि आपको वो पोस्ट मिल जाएगा दिस इज जस्ट अ क्वालिफाइंग एग्जाम दिस इज फॉर द लेक्चर एंड असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर मिनिमम क्वालिफिकेशन फॉर द एग्रीकल्चर यूनिवर्सिटीज ओनली Now we will know what are the plan for the examination. So ये paper किस तरह होने वाला है So this is the combined paper for all these three exam that is NET, ARS and STO. So ओ सो ये एग्जाम जो है वन फिफ्टी मार्क्स का होगा जिसमें कि वन फिफ्टी ऑब्जेक्टिव टाइप टाइप मल्टीपल चॉइस क्वेश्चन होंगे जिससे कि टू आवर्स का टाइम मिलेगा आपको करने के लिए एंड दिस मिनिमम क्वालिफाइंग मार्क्स फॉर द नेट इल बी फिफ्टी परसेंटेज दैट मीन्स सेवेंटी फाइव मार्क्स आपको लाना है एंड दैट डजेंट मीन दैट यू विल गेट द Eligibility for the lectureship and assistant professor. If you get the fifty percent mark, I'm talking about the unreserved category. Similarly for other categories, OBC and SC, ST, it is given forty five and forty respectively. So if you're able to qualify fifty percent, then also you will not be sure that you have qualified this ASRB Agriculture NET because from there some students, some percentage will be qualifying for the NET that is assistant professor or lectureship for this exam. but minimum qualifying marks you have to secure 50 as per the unreserved category now we will know that what are the papers under this yes like ugc net is having different papers environmental science physics chemistry all these are coming from csir and ugc net similarly for this asrb net there are many number of papers and you can give any paper if you want according to your own subject yes there are agriculture biotechnology agriculture entomology these things are related to agriculture and also environmental science is one of the papers in which you can apply for the net part yes here aapko agar environmental science mein dena hai aapke liye agar aapka subject environmental science hai then you can choose for this while filling up the form now we will know that what are the vacancy position for the ars exam yes ab hum aa jate hain next exam jo ki hai agriculture research service सो दिस इज द सेकेंड एग्जाम बट एक ही एग्जाम आपको देना है सो दिस इज द सेकेंड पोस्ट एक्चुअली सो देर आर डिफरेंट वैकेंसी पोजिशन अकॉर्डिंग टू द रिक्वायरमेंट बाय द आई सी आर सो दिस विल बी फॉर एग्जाम्पल एग्रीकल्चर एंटोमोलॉजी एग्रीकल्चर माइक्रोबायोलॉजी एंड एनवायरमेंटल साइंस ऑल्सो यू आर हैविंग फोर नंबर ऑफ वैकेंसीज सो फॉर दिस एग्रीकल्चर रिसर्च सर्विस यू हैव टू गो थ्रू द थ्री स्टेजेस दैट इज द प्रिलिमिनरी एग्जाम दैट इज ऑब्जेक्टिव टाइप देन इट विल बी मेन्स इफ यू क्वालिफाई and then it will be the viva was so the preliminary exam will be 150 marks as we have discussed earlier that is the common exam then if you qualify then you will be going for the mains exam that will be descriptive type then finally it will be viva was so, so next we know for the senior technical officer sto ke liye aapko kya karna padega so if you are applying for the sto you have to apply for the prelims exam and this is actually this exam senior technical officer is recruitment for the post in different icr headquarters and its research institute so what will be the pay scale so the pay scale will vary from the 15600 to 177500 so it will depend upon which headquarter is offering and what is the post agar aap senior technical officer ke liye apply kar rahe hain to aapko ye form bharna padega iska preliminary exam bhi dena hai and then you have to go for the interview round so isme do stages hai as we have discussed senior technical officer one will be the combined exam that is online and one will be the interview so the next thing is 
what are the vacancies for example if you are planning to apply for the STO job that is senior technical officer you should see that what are the qualification what are the vacancy where are the vacancy and what net discipline you have to apply yes ye important hai agar aapko sirf apply karna hai environmental science ke net discipline mein but here this time there is no vacancy for the STO that is senior technical officer in the net discipline of environmental science but different discipline hai agronomy computer application farm machinery so if you are applying for this net category then you will be able to get vacancy as per this so i have not included all the vacancy on all the institute location you can go through all this in the brochure i will attach in the description but for environmental science there is no vacancy in sto i will tell you i because i have read the brochure completely now we will know the plan of examination for sto so if you are applying for any other uh, syllabus or any other discipline then you should know sto ke liye ek exam hoga wo bhi 150 marks ka hai interview hoga jo ki 30 marks ka hai and combinedly you will be getting 180 marks total and accordingly you will get the marks and you will be selected so next thing is for minimum qualifying marks for STO if you are applying for that one combined exam then you have to appear and you have to get at least 50% in that qualifying exam then only you will be called for the interview as per the shortlisting of candidates so it is also not telling that if you are getting 50% more then you will be called for interview it is just the qualifying marks after that it will be depending upon the number of candidates applied and qualified more than 50% so ye tha teen cheez jo ki net ars and sto ke bare mein so these are different disciplines i will remind you you should go into this and see that whether your discipline for example environmental science is there in sto or not and in the agriculture research service also there are different vacancies as per the position in the uh, required disciplines for your कन्वीनियंस सो यू शुड नो दिस थिंग्स ए आर एस के लिए एनवायरमेंटल साइंस के लिए फोर वैकेंसी है जो कि एग्रीकल्चर रिसर्च सर्विस है अगर आपको ओनली नेट के लिए अप्लाई करना है तो यू कैन ऑल्सो अप्लाई नेट पेपर ऑल्सो सो आई होप योर ऑल डाउट्स आर क्लियर इफ यू हैव मोर डाउट्स यू कैन आस्क मी इन द कमेंट सेक्शन सो दिस वॉज ऑल अबाउट दिस ए एस आर बी नेट ए आर एस एंड एस टी ओ सो यू कैन लुक फॉर द सिलेबस इट इज ऑल्सो गिवन इन द वेबसाइट सो दीज आर द कम्बाइंड एग्जाम वन विल बी कंडक्टेड फॉर दिस थ्री पोस्ट दैट इज नेट agriculture research service and senior technical officer and in the net you will be only eligible for the assistant professor and lecturer in the ars you can go for the agriculture research service in which the vacancy for environmental science is four and in senior technical officer there is no vacancy for environmental science so you can choose accordingly and you can apply in the website for the application and then you can prepare accordingly so if you want more such updates you can comment me in the comment section and don't forget to subscribe the channel to get all further updates in the future so see you guys in our next video